get an X for me. Where's my attack? Attack, I need an X. I think I'm pretty vocal. I like to try to keep it loose on the sidelines, but when it comes to crunch time, it becomes all business for me. Ah! Oh! Yeah, here, here. Come on, we gotta go! It's holding me! I think there's a fine line, a balance, and gauging how the team is and you know, trying to help my teammates, especially the young guys, be successful. I'm going through, say hi, Nick. Say hi, follow it, Nick. Follow it, Nick. <laughs> Some of the guys on the team were like, oh, I remember in 2010 coming to uh, your quarterfinal game versus Virginia, and then they'll follow it up with saying something like, yeah, I was in middle school, or I was a freshman in high school, which makes me feel old, but it's kind of cool to be that guy now that when I came into the league, I was playing with guys that were older that I watched growing up. My grandpa played lacrosse when he was growing up. My uncle was a brine rep back in the day, so I've been using brine and warrior gear since I was a little kid, and that was always a company that I wanted to work for. The support team takes care of you. You really feel like a professional athlete when you're being endorsed by New Balance. I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do after college kind of stayed in the lacrosse circuit playing professionally and then my business partner now approached me and said hey I'm gonna start running box lacrosse in Philadelphia are you interested in helping me out we started fusion lacrosse in 2013 now we've got seven teams from third grade to 11th grade and we run an all-star box cross team called Penlax All-Stars. There's a lot of coaching going on earlier in the summer we have them going to two or three tournaments so practices midweek I run the social media for Fusion, so trying to stay on top of everything that's going on in the lacrosse world. I coach at a high school called the Shipley School in Bryn Mawr. I have the middle school team from three to four, and then the varsity team from four to six. So the spring season, it's pretty busy for me, but I get to do what I'm passionate about. <laughs> we need someone who can draw a double, right? Okay. Like we got, it's me with the long pole and Justin with the short stick, right? Gotcha. Played with Dan Dawson early in my career, and one thing he said to me really stood out. It was thinking long term. Yes. I'm at the level I'm at now because I was out in the backyard playing with my neighbors till the sun went down. My mom had to call me in for dinner. Serious speed, baby. What's our mascot's name? Quiz question. Go. Good job. I was getting better, but I was enjoying what I was doing. I was loving the game. So if I can help foster a love for the game in these kids, I think that's going to take them further than any skill I can drill over and over again into their heads.